Hello everyone, this is Dr. Pooja Patil, Assistant Professor, Environment Management Department, Cyber, Kolhapur. Today I am going to talk on an innovative method for treatment of industrial wastewater by using green synthesized titanium dioxide nanoparticles. So let's see the contents of the topic. So first we will discuss about the status of water, then impacts of conventional wastewater treatment plants, then emergence of nanotechnology, then application of chemical synthesized titanium dioxide nanoparticles, benefits of green synthesized titanium dioxide nanoparticles, precipitation or preparation of leaf extract, designs and operation of parabolic reactor, results and conclusion. Let's see the status of water. So we all know that water is essential for the existence of animals, humans as well as plants life. Earth is covered with the 71% of the water. Out of that, 97% is salty water. Even though the salty water is plenty in amount, we cannot use it for the drinking, domestic and for agriculture purpose. Increased in population has increased in demands of goods, which in turn causes rapid industrialization. And rapid industrialization is a major source of water pollution. Less than 3% is fresh water available on the earth. Out of that, roughly 1% we can use it for the drinking purpose. And every day, 2.1 billion people lack access to clean water for drinking as well as for the domestic purposes. So, there is a crucial need for the treatment of industrial wastewater. So, conventional wastewater treatment plants do not efficiently remove the color and other pollutants from the treated wastewater. The presence of poorly degradable tannins, metals like chromium, cadmium and high concentrations of salt inhibits the biological treatment. In addition, there is a high energy demand, operation cost and maintenance cost, post treatment and excess slugs production also discredits the conventional wastewater treatment plants. Several physicochemical treatments like coagulation, flocculation, sedimentation are being applied for the treatment of industrial wastewater. But this use a huge amount of chemicals and thus are environmentally destructive. So considering this demerits of conventional wastewater treatment plant, we are focusing on the nanotechnology. Nanotechnology offers a great potential for the development of next generation and it could replace the conventional wastewater treatment plants. Nanotechnology offers a new strategies to reduce pollution in various processes like improved method for reducing pollution, waste treatment, environmental sensing, remediation, and making alternative energy sources more cost effective. Nanotechnology also has an enormous potential for providing innovative solution to the wide range of environmental issues. Nanoparticles, especially chemically synthesized titanium dioxide nanoparticles have extensively applied in the photocatalytic treatment of industrial wastewater. Nano-sized titanium dioxide nanoparticles are best on the photocatalytic treatment and it is extensively applied in a large scale method for treatment of organic and inorganic pollutants existed in an industrial wastewater. A chemically synthesized nanoparticles under the specific condition requires high expensive toxic and hazardous chemicals and they are released in the environment creates a serious ecotoxicological issue. So concerning this ecotoxicity of chemically synthesized titanium dioxide nanoparticles 
This method focuses on the green synthesized titanium dioxide nanoparticles which includes biological and organic matter acts as a capping and reducing method agents it requires less manpower low cost it is energy saving process and also it is a cost effective and utilized for the large scale production it is less toxic eco friendly and it requires less amount of or no chemical for the treatment processes let's see the preparation of plants extract so the plant leaves were washed and air dried then they are been boiled at 80 degrees celsius for 40 minutes after boiling they are been cooled at room temperature and then it has been filtered with watman filter paper then Titanium chloride has been added as a precursor with the plant extract in one to one ratio. After that, the color change has been observed from white to green or to brown. It indicates that titanium dioxide nanoparticles, green synthesized titanium dioxide nanoparticles, are ready. Then after. the ammonia has been added to get a precipitate after that they are been washed with ethyl alcohol to remove the impurities then they are been cooled and calcinated in a muffled furnace for 4 hours at 400 degrees celsius then grind at mortar and pestle to obtain a final powder then they have been placed or inserted in parabolic reactor for the treatment of industrial waste water let's see the design and operation of parabolic reactor stainless steel aluminium chrome plated cup has been placed or mounted in a parabolic reactor then it has been attached with uv transparent glass tube then the uv transparent glass tube were fitted with the rubber pipes for the proper circulation of industrial waste water and it has been connected to a tank where titanium dioxide green synthesized titanium dioxide nanoparticles and waste water has been present and it contains submersible motor pump for the proper circulation of waste water then the water has been circulated daily in a summer season or at a sunny rays for 8 hours and after treatment of industrial waste water it has been kept for the settling purpose of titanium dioxide nanoparticles and they are been removed before and after analysis of industrial waste water is been done before the industrial waste water contains brown color and after treatment it is been colorless before treatment the ph of water is slightly acidic and after treatment it is neutral after treatment the dissolved oxygen that is do level has been improved by 40 to 50% after treatment the biological oxygen demand and chemical oxygen demand was approximately reduced by 60 to 70%. There is a remarkable reduction in chromium level. About 82% of the chromium was removed and efficiently the waste water has been treated with green synthesized titanium dioxide nanoparticles. So from our results it has been concluded that the nanotechnology offers a great potential for the development of industrial waste water nanoparticles especially the chemical synthesized titanium dioxide nanoparticles has been ex extensively applied in a photocatalytic treatment of industrial waste water but the green synthesized titanium dioxide nanoparticles is simple eco friendly less toxic way of synthesizing nanoparticles from biodegradable materials such as plant extract 
microbes and enzymes are used in this method. So moreover, the application of green synthesized titanium dioxide nanoparticles for industrial wastewater treatment could be an excellent strategy to cope with the environmental pollution. For treatment of industrial wastewater, nanotechnology has many avenues to explore, resolve and solve environmental problems. Thank you.